Woo. Keep going. Go Big far, steps. Mrs. Legs, huh? I know I. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at you. Yeah, little man's cleaning his bed while I get ready. Yeah? You going to play by your minute? Yeah? I got some bits and pieces out for them to play. <laughs> hey guys! Right, um, I'm ready as you can see and I've got some makeup on and I feel ten times better today. And I'm devastated this morning because I've only gone and run out of foundation. So I'm sorry if I look a bit orange. I thought I had a little bit left of my old one. So yeah. So little man's all dressed. He's looking perfect as usual. I'll show you. Here he is. Hello, sexy. <laughs> Good morning, guys. So this morning I've been called into work. So I've had to leave Kelly and the baby in the house. Um, it's a really nice day today, so I think we're gonna go out today and do something. And I will see you in five. He's a little bit, a little bit hungry, so I've given him some milkshake in a cup. So it'll be the second time you've had a milkshake, and I give him some bits of chicken so he can feed himself because I want to do. Partly, I want to do a bit of self weaning. Um, I'm not like all for it you know i'm not like no it's gotta feed himself it's gotta feed himself because i know it sounds sad but i enjoy feeding him and he's grown up too fast for me so yeah i still want to treat him like my baby yeah so he's just having a bit of fun you know picking it up and doing himself making a mess why not and um, in here um i have got a tommy tp cap but it's got a rubber rubber top, which is a non-spill, but he just chews it. He just doesn't know how to suck out of it. Give him this, just a cheap thing, and he loves it. I did try to breastfeed. Um, I breastfed for three days when he was born, and I was really passionate about it. And I was like, I want to breastfeed, I want to breastfeed. But um, it came to the third day of breastfeeding, and my milk was, wasn't still coming through. He was on my breast for 45 minutes and he would sleep or he'd be fine for about hour, hour to hour and 15 minutes and then he wanted to go back on a breast again. So every two hours he was on me and that was 24-7. It wasn't even, he was sleeping for a few hours, it was every two hours and I was exhausted. Um, and because no milk was actually coming through, I got really, really upset and I was like, oh no, he's not, it's not satisfying him, it's not enough. So, uh, basically my auntie and Ross sat down and they was like, look, do what you feel is best. If you don't think that, you know, your breasts are satisfying him, if you get really upset, then put, it, put him on powdered milk. So... We went out, we got that powdered milk, gave him one bottle, satisfied. Literally, he was a different baby. And then it went straight to every three hours, and four hours, and now he's every three to four hours still. So yeah, it, was, oh, it saved me. <laughs> but um, the following day, after that full day of drinking powdered milk, sorry, I was so bunged up. Yeah, so, um, after that day, give, give him a full day of just powdered milk, formula milk, um, I was sat in the bath, trying to relax, trying to, you know, contain myself, and everything, so I was so emotional, and my milk came through. I was like, you've got to be kidding me. Here you go. You've got to be kidding me. 
you know, after how badly I wanted to breastfeed and then <laughs> the following day after giving him powdered milk, which is formula milk, my milk comes through. I was devastated. And then it was the situation of, should I just leave the powdered milk now or should I just, just portray him again now on my breast? And at that time, I felt, well, I know for a fact that the formula milk is satisfying him, he's happy, but if, fingers crossed, if I had another baby, um, which I doubt it, because it took me so long to have him, I'm just, I'm so blessed, so honoured, I can't even describe to you how lucky I am to have a baby, and I'm not rubbing into people's faces. Is that nice? Is that nice? What are you eating? First time taking food out of a bowl. Hey babes. Oh you enjoying them now? Some chicken nuggets. <laughs> We're on our way to Victoria Gardens before we go and get paint because we've just come up with a bright spark of playing with bubbles. Oh, what was that? Wee! <laughs> there we go! What are you doing? <laughs> oh, he's a big boy. You stuck? <laughs> he's like, no more. Whoa, oh, one more. Two. Whoa. Keep going. Go big steps. Legs, huh? I know why. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at you. <laughs> <laughs> he's going on a mission. Did he look at in? <laughs> I know, I couldn't even keep up with him then. No fun in the park. I think Kelly had more fun than the baby blowing bubbles. <laughs> I love it. But we had a blast. Yeah, we took some we took amazing pictures. Yeah. But I think what we had to do just put them on Twitter. Twitter? Uh, Twitter? Tweet tweet. tweet, tweet. <laughs> but yeah, we'll put them on Twitter. So you can have Big Aboo. Hey Daddy Boy. <laughs> We didn't manage to do any painting today because we spent so long at the park, at the Victoria Gardens. Um, so I take it that's now going to be tomorrow. And <laughs> they've gone crazy. <laughs> and tried to settle down this little man. So good night from me. And Good night from me. I'm Mr. Wyatt. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Go. Mm.